hello guys i welcome you to my youtube channel the name is still dj kbsl and today i'm here with another tutorial today i'm about to teach how to change your vector dj scratch sound to sound like a controller and i hope this is going to help a lot of you who like scratching the default scratch sound like this and after we are done it's going to sound like this and I'll show you how to scratch with this particular keys. Or I'm going to teach you how to scratch this pattern. So without wasting much of your time, let's go to our settings and we will type the script together. So click on settings and click on controllers and click on advanced editor. So I all already have the scratch keys, but I'm going to choose another mapping so we would get the space and retype it again. So we are going to use key three for the scratch and key, uh, key two for our hot cue that will play the song after we scratch. Okay, so let's type our scratch script. So you type hot Q, sorry, hot Q, space, space, and then you type pause, space, and space, then you type scratch, space, then you type positive or negative uh, or plus 120, 120 ms space then you type and space again then you type up space then you type question mark space then you type scratch again this one you uh, give one space again and type negative or minus 120 ms so this is the scratch script so let's test it and see whether it's working or not all right so it is working so it left the hot cue to type hot cue hot cue that is all we need for the scratch all right so now let me teach you how to change the scratch sound so first of all the normal scratch sound like this and we want to change it to sound like this so what you are going to do is that you push your mouse case or your mouse pointer on the juggle and double click and hold and drag it slowly like this or you can right click on your or your touchpad right click and drag it slowly either forward or back so this is how it is and those of you using max you right click and hold and drag it slowly so let's go like this you can see i push it slowly and let's click on let's press on our touch key and see you can see it has changed so you need to do it slowly and you have to play with it to get the correct sound sometimes you do it once and you get the sound or sound of the controller or the scratch sound like a controller but if you didn't get it keep on trying it or keep on pushing it slowly and you get it so you can see you can see it has changed again you can see you can see this one is too slow so you need to do it again you can see now i've get the perfect sound for for my for me it sound good yeah so i don't know about you you can play with it how you want it and it will work like that for you so right now we are finished changing the sound 
so uh, let me teach you how to play with this particular pattern like this so you already know that we have our hot cue after we finish scratching we press on the hot cue to play the song for us and this hot cue plays under the hot cues if you set your hot cue to hot key 3 and you press on the 2 it will pick it from there or to start the song from there it is up to 5 it will start from there so you can see right now this one hot cue 1 when we press on it it will pick when it is hot cue 2 and we press on it it will pick it hot cue 3 it will pick it so it <coughs> sorry it is a universal hot cue it's play under the hot cue all right so this is the pattern that i'm coming to teach you so we will use both both keys the scratch and the hot cue so it goes like this sorry all right so this is how the pattern is so let me break it down for you So let's play an instrumental and see how it will sound or how it looks on instrumental. So like this, let me play this. I have so many patterns but it is hard for me to break it down so keep on practice and when you get the experience you too you can create a different style of playing or scratching it with it with the key yeah, so you can see I have so many patterns like this So in my next video, I'm going to teach how to scratch with this same particular key, like a chip scratch, that chip scratch or chip scratch. So it goes like this. So we'll meet in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.